All right, folks, we're back at the camp. Hey, last night we went fishing. This is the only stripe we caught. They were a little finicky. The water's muddy, as you could see, uh, through the trip, the whole trip. So um, we caught this one stripe, and then we went spotted bass fishing the next morning. Had a, had a fun time fishing back in the coves and the run-ins. But uh, we're gonna get this stripe clean and uh, get it cooked. So uh, yeah, here we go, let's do it. I like to uh, go down the backbone right here. It saves a little more meat. You just go down the backbone line right there. Like so. Perfect. And you can shave a little bit off. Yes. Cut right above the ribs. Awesome. Now that all the ribs and everything's attached. Flip it over, grab the skin. And then, there's our filet. Now these stripers, they'll have a red stripe in it, and it's good to take that, take that out. So it's almost, you wanna uh, get your knife and just get all that red stripe off. It's like double filet in it. All right, so now I got the red stripe cut off but you also want to get this little part and I just like to basically cut it all the way through in a V shape just like that got two little fillets that's nice and boneless we'll get that little part off right there nice and clean and then here's your bigger part and they, there are some pin bones on you just got to check run your finger check for those pin bones but right there it is nice little filet it's gonna taste good oh Gus 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 no sir lay ease down ease down come on man hey it's not duck season folks we're out here at Lewis Smith Lake I mean this lake has risen like three feet since today it's unbelievable we've had major major thunder showers but um hey we're cooking come over here let me show you we got the fish cleaned up so we got them here in the bowls remember the stripe the stripes down here somewhere underneath all these all these fillets but yes we're gonna get them seasoned up got the lemons here it's always good to, uh yes you cannot shoot the ducks it's not duck season he's wanting to shoot the ducks so bad Right here, just admire the beauty right now and the geese. Can't shoot the duck. All right. Look, my dad's here with me. Daddy, come over here. Introduce you. That's my dad. Larry, hey. He raised me on this lake right here. We went hunting and fishing and camping. Lots of good memories. Boating. But, uh. Yeah. So he, he come out here. We're going to feast tonight and enjoy these fish. Good old Smith Lake fish this evening. But, uh. Yeah, a lot of good memories with my dad right here on Lewis Smith Lake. Ain't that right? Right. Yep. Gus, Gus is wanting to shoot the ducks, but leave him alone. Listen at him. He's calling them up. <laughs> All right, well, look right here. So we went out, we tried to catch some stripe at night, but yeah, it was tough. Hey, trying to catch a stripe, but uh, we got one. As you, as you guys can see, and uh, we're gonna cook it up. We love eating these grilled stripe. Hey, that's got a little oily flavor, and uh, we got some spotted bass to go with it, so uh, it's gonna be awesome. I like to take lemon. You can just cut it up. Half a lemon right there. Gus, don't shoot the ducks. No, sir. God. Boys want to kill some. They swam right there by him like 10 yards. He can't resist it. He can't resist it. But yeah, just take your lemon. Look, just squeeze it. 
we're here at uh, at a rental house, so you got to deal with what you got. But got the bowl here. You just squeeze the lemon on it. This help tenderizes it and also gives it a nice flavor. All right, folks, storm's coming in, so I'm gonna get this seasoned up and on the grill quick. We gotta get that stripe nice and seasoned. Get it on both sides right there. I already got lemon on it. Yes. And then get you some tin foil on your grill. It would have been, I could have, that was a small stripe, so I could have left the skin on it and I probably shouldn't have, but oh well, she's done now. And then uh, just get your tin foil throw it on there. I'm going to get a little olive oil or spray and put it on there too. But I'm keeping the winds blowing. I got to keep the tin foil down. Aluminum foil with the fish. There it is. Right there. That's going to sizzle nice right there. Set on the grill maybe about 10 minutes. Talking to us. Talking to us. We got to get this cooked. But uh, yeah, there it goes. So we'll show y'all the finished product. A little taste test inside, see how they like it. Oh yeah, that is sizzling nice, looking good. Yes, she's done. We added the bass fillets to the stripe. But look at that, nice and blackened, grilled fish right there, it just falls apart. Look at that, that's that stripe piece right there, I like it, it's a little thicker. Holds together nice. Boom. We're gonna get that inside right there, but look at that. Mmm. That smoke rolling off of it. Boy, that looks good right there. Yes! I'm excited. I'm about to get in here and eat it. Alright, folks, now it's time for the taste test right here. We got already. Well no. This right here is taste test. We got two different species right here. Who, who's going first? Me! Alright, here you go. What is this? Try that. Right? Here, get you a bigger piece. Let me help mm, you. Mm, 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 mm. What is that? You like that? Right? Is that fun? Yep. Mm, let me try the different species. Alright, here, you try this first. Big bite, so. You like it? This is super good. Mm. I like it though. That's tasty, man. Right there. So tasty. That's the young stripe right there. Do you like it or here? Taste this, Gus. I'll taste that. All right. Which one you like, baby? You like the stripe or the, or the bass? Spotted bass? Bass. You like the bass? Bass is good. What do you think, Gus? I will try that. You did? What do you like? Spotted? What is that? That's the spotted bass. Spotted That's bass. the strap. You like the spotted bass? Both. Both? That works. That's what I'm talking about. What do you like? So, that's the spotted bass. I like this better. The stripe. So, the, the striped bass is a little more oily with bigger flakes. If that's, if that's what you like, that's going to be your favorite. And the, the spotted bass is um, a real thin white fish and it's uh i like it just as much too but it's got a different texture a little more flaky less uh you know thick and oily like the stripe is but hey hope you guys enjoyed it what an awesome time we had here at lewis smith lake hey you guys know what to do hey subscribe to the channel hit the like button click the notification symbol We'll see you next time Please. on Real Life Please with down. Lucas Black. So I should slap it. Got it. Hey, you know the chef. The chef always has to try it before everybody else. Okay. Apparently, I'm gonna try it before the chef. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, melt in your mouth. Mm. Mm. Taste. Mm -hmm.